on October 20th, the first patch for Bone Labs released. In this patch, there are a few changes related to the capsules. The first one we're going to talk about is the 1911 and empty capsule on the ascent. At the end of the ascent, the empty capsule that was supposed to have the 1911 is still empty. Nothing inside of it. On the upside, we have been given the 1911 by default, so now anybody with a spawner can get it. In the first level descent, a poster was added to help guide players on how to open the capsules. Because if you were like me, I didn't understand how to open them, and it took me until all the way up until getting the first avatar strong to understand I needed to pull them apart. Those arrows that appeared on the side of it for a moment there, right there, I didn't understand what that meant. I thought it just meant to twist it. But they added the poster to help people out. In the very last section of level 3 long run, there is a hidden capsule that's below the train, so you can't actually see it. If you go right over to this corner, it doesn't look like there's anything there. If we reach out our hand, you can see a small dot appear there. And there it is. Hidden capsule. Gym block A. On level 8, Magma Gate, the skeleton avatar is added, so now you can change into it. In this cage here, this cage is on a hinge from, so you just have to pop it up, and the skeleton rolls right out. And if we head to the body mall of the hub here, on the very last page, I can select the skeleton and change into it. Now we can play as the skeleton. Unfortunately, we're still not able to spawn the skeletons in. If I go to the utilities menu, to beings, and on the all section, no skeleton there. At least we can play as it though. I'll let you guys know if there's any more changes to secrets in the game or unlockables in future patches. Until then, thanks for watching.